welcome back to another vlog today is actually a pretty busy day we've got to organize a whole bunch of stuff and i want to be completely updated with everything so i've got to do sneaker laundry orders i've got to finish doing some embroidery right here this one is for zach so he's coming up with like his own clothing line and he's asked me to do some embroidery for him i've actually been up to date with the essential pieces pet hoodies but i've just got to do all last night's orders and today's orders i don't think there's any today because it's still super early but it should be a good day it's going to be busy we're going to try to get as much as we can done because tomorrow supposedly how we'll get his car back which means we probably won't have much time at the warehouse because we've got to go drive all the way for like an hour hour and a half because it is on the other side to pick it up bring it back all of that stuff i just realized my face is like so shiny at the moment i'm using like a new foundation today it's kind of given me like a nice glow but i also use like the touch of dewy mist and that is like making my face like look at that my face is so shiny there it's insane i'm hoping it kind of wears off throughout the day anyways let's start doing the orders first hope you guys enjoy this time <laughs> morning guys welcome back to another video i'm pretty sure philly has already introduced the video but you guys haven't seen me for a while just because i mean during this vlog just because i went to go visit my dad in hospital if you guys know about my dad you guys know if you guys don't then you guys don't i i posted a video maybe like two years ago three years ago regarding my dad's situation and i did take some time off um youtube and i feel like i might be taking off some time really really soon but anyway guys right now i'm doing some really brainless stuff to get my mind off things but Philly's like, what are you doing? But I'm creating more space in the warehouse. Let me show you guys. You guys can see already that I cleared out all these boxes already and I created more space on this side. So what I did, you guys probably, I don't know, I don't know if you guys really paid deep attention to it, but I pulled these racks forward because they were back a row and then I stacked all this high, oh, excuse me, I just burped. That's really disgusting. Uh, higher as well, so I can fit more. And then I'm just hiding things away on this side. So this is like all our spare containers. Our fans are ready for summer. I can't wait for summer. I can't wait for you to use you, buddy. But everything's looking good. Oh, okay, actually, someone gave me a good idea. I, I forgot who it was, but shout out to you. Because currently our stickers look like this, right? So uh, someone's comment was like, you should get a A4 slip in a plastic, put an A4 piece of paper in it, have the name of the item and a photo of the item and what it is. That's a great idea. This is why I love the subscribers and I love telling you guys everything so you guys can actually help me. And that's great. All right, it is done now. You guys can't really tell the difference, but when I turn you guys around here, look at that. It's all empty now. Now we can finally use this as a photo shoot wall. That's like literally what it's supposed to be and it never became. And now it just looks, how better is it, babe? It's so good. Like I have all this free space now. Because before it was just like, it, it's such a big space, but it still felt confined because of all the boxes coming in like this much and being stacked high. Now it's good. And actually we can see the painting that we did. That's true. true. That's true. We haven't seen our painting job for a while since we painted it. But yeah, I still got to move these boxes. These will fit nicely in this space right here and they can go all the way up. And now this whole thing is just properly jam packed and as much space. Well, even though this is like stacked so high, it looks pretty crazy, but it kind of hides all of the shelving. Like yeah. all the messiness back there, which is kind of good. Yeah, this has been a, a lot of work. Because these are um, 10, kilos, 10 kilos each. They're not light, and I stacked a lot of them. You didn't today, babe. Huh? You didn't need to go to gym today. <laughs> yeah, bad. Um, but I still got to move all these, and then, yeah, should be good. After that hard work, I want to finish it off with making some signs for our door. Because um, we don't actually have a sign on our door. So I'm actually going to put the three up so it looks really, really cool. Um, I'm actually super, super, super happy with how it turned out looks so good now this just looks a bit more busy but it's all good 
I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like on our door. Just got done finishing all of these embroideries. These colors are just like so bright. Kind of reminds me of primary school, like the red, the yellow. I just need like the blue and the green, but it's worked out pretty well. It was nice and easy to do. I had no troubles because this logo was easy. The only little bit was the end. So for some of them, it isn't a thousand percent neat. Like if you can see here, there's little bits. So I've kind of need to probably finish it up and just like, neaten that up somehow i don't know how i'm gonna do that but i'll figure that out but look at this space here we did this just then and it is completely different to what it used to look like so before this table was actually set in the middle and it was going down vertically i would say and now we've kind of made it into like this square c rectangle shape so when you come in the door over here this is what the space looks like just because this side of the wall it actually looks really bare and like big and just like not right i think this is a lot better the only one bad thing about it is that this table is now so far away from the embroidery machine but i'll get used to it what i actually want to do as well is buy a rug for this like square space in the middle i'm not sure if i want to get a round rug or a rectangle rug i'm just looking on Kmart at the moment i did look on ebay but their rugs are so expensive for the one I want. I want to get, I think it's called a jute rug. So it's kind of a rug that's that like woven type material. Because I think if I get a fabric rug, it's going to get dirty really, really easy. And all the dog fur is going to be more visible, more vacuuming. It's just not going to be good at all. Especially because I'll always be wearing shoes here. It'll be dusty, all of that stuff. So I think a jute rug will be good. But the pricing that I want to get it at it's like $200 for a good size that will fit here. But I found one on Kmart. It's only, I think, $70 for the exact same size, which is a pretty good bargain. So I might go buy that later on tonight. This is my little dodgy measurement. So I've got a pair of scissors here. This is where the rug goes. And this is where the rug ends. I think if I can move it, it'll probably just fit this space correctly. And then I've got another measurement over here, which this point, is where the rug will go as well, which I think it's perfect. So it will just fit this area. I'm gonna show you guys the back of the door so you guys can see, but you guys, all the decals are up now. It kind of, kind of gives it like the Pablo Kanye look, you guys can see. But now what I'm gonna do is finish off stock take and I've only got a few more things to count. I'll show you guys, all this is all done. I consolidated a lot of the boxes I just need to count these. See, quarter zip jackets, there's not a lot left. There's like three sizes in this one. Tech jackets, uh, Borg jackets. See, these are the only Borg jackets that are left, so I might as well just put them online. And some shorts. These are uh, really old season shorts. These are like summer last. And there's not that many. There's like three in that box. And there's maybe about five in this box. So I'm just gonna consolidate as much as I can. Oh, and acid wash hoodies. There's only like one full box left. That's about a full box of these is about only 20 hoodies, and there's like four sizes, so there's not that many left. So I might as well put those up one online as well. but I'm having so much fun pushing this pram around. That just proves how much space that there is and how creative just with moving a couple of boxes. I can just push Biggie around in the pram all day long. He's just having a fun time. I really wish Honey could fit in here though, but the pram's just a little bit too big. There was the option of getting a double pram like when I was buying it, but it was just a bit too expensive. And I honestly thought that they would fit in here, but it's not gonna work. Still, Biggie's loving life. We are back home now, or I'm back home house, probably on his way now, back now, but I did a little bit of a grocery shop. Tonight I'm gonna to be making chicken katsu curry. I made this a couple of weeks ago. Turned out pretty good, so I'm gonna try and make it again. This time, Hal's gonna be able to try it as well, because last time he ended up staying at the warehouse later than usual. But I ended up even buying like two bowls just for this certain dish, because last time when I was having it, I a plate just, does not do it justice because I mean you're eating a curry it's kind of like runny so a plate is flat it's just not working and then the bowl that I had it was a good bowl but we only have one of those so I got these ones from Coles which is like it was labeled as a pasta bowl it's like got a little bit of a deep 
pan to it. I don't know what you call it. Anyways, these are pretty cheap as well. I think it was two dollars for these, so can't say no to that. That's all I have with my curry. But if anybody likes pond dumplings at the moment, Woolworths has a sale, and these are only eight bucks for a family pack. So it was half price, and there's 32 pieces, which is a crazy bargain because these are usually like nearly twenty dollars. Even if you go to Costco, it is a lot cheaper, but sometimes you kind of need the membership for that. So yeah, Woolworths, half price. <laughs> Anyways, I'm gonna start cooking and getting everything ready, and it should be good. We also stocked up on these at Chemist Warehouse. These are super cheap. You can get a pack of five pairs for, I think it's $4, and we're heading to the snow next week. So these are gonna be so handy, and it's gonna keep us nice and warm. Be nice. We get it. Look at him. But we are home now. Philly cooked us some um, chicken. Chicken? Katsu curry, yeah. Chicken katsu curry looks really, really good. Guys, the bowl that I bought, it just does it. It just makes it look way better than last time when I was eating it. Did you notice this is new? No, nah, I really <laughs> noticed this kind of thing. Sorry, babe. But what are we going to watch now? I bet you we're going to watch Men in Black, yeah? Yes, we're going to watch Men so in Black So we too. watched number one last night and I've, I've kind of seen number one but not fully because we watched the new one out last week and it was pretty good and he's like, as if you've never seen like one, two, is there three? Yes. So yeah, now he's making me watch them all. What, number one, the original one was pretty good. Because this is like, like uh, Men in Black one was before Will Smith was like super famous and now like, it's it's so good. I, I reckon the, men, the new Men in Black is trash but... Anyway guys, let's watch. I'll speak to you guys on tomorrow. Let's pick this up back tomorrow. It is the next day right now. As you guys can see, I'm in front of my computer. I'm actually editing this vlog right here, right now. What I'm gonna do is just quickly address a few things that I know that people are wondering. So, um, August 1st, the Cocaine Online Drop will be releasing a whole bunch of Old stock, as you guys already know, the last two or three days, me and Philly have been doing stock take on um, all the old stock, all the stuff that we want to do as well. We're going to do, be, we will be doing a whole bunch of giveaways from probably August 2nd to for the first two weeks of the new release. So we do have a uh, photo shoot for all the new goods that you guys have seen previously on this video, on these vlogs. If you haven't, just skip back a couple of vlogs and you'll see all the new stuff. And also, um, we want to release all the brand new things on August 2nd. So the first photo on August 2nd should be the new line. I'm, I usually just hide all the previous stuff on, on the Instagram and stuff like that. Um, also, uh, our current house uh, situation, we're still at our current house, but we haven't been able to find an apartment that um, we really, really like. We have applied for another one. We haven't heard back as of yet but i'm super super excited uh, for this one um another thing that you guys have been asking as well um actually do you know what i'm gonna do i'm just gonna pull this towards here shout out to you guys for um commenting first I i'll leave this comment section loading whilst i talk to you guys but um the podcast the podcast is coming back there are still bits and pieces that i i want to use this table as the podcast table and at the same time as the table that I use every single day to actually do work and stuff like that. So I'm still trying to figure out how clean it's going to look. And this is probably gonna be how the look is going to be. But as you guys can see um, behind the comment section, the LED lighting on, on that side right there, it, it is beaming off the lens and, I'm, and I don't wanna turn off the lights up here as well to make it look nicer. I, I really don't know what the look is going to be. Um, and there's actually one thing I want to say, but I'm gonna let this comment section go and then... All right, that's enough of that comment section. Um, guys, can you please, please, I'm just gonna say this, please, um, respect Jamie and Nikki's privacy and don't comment anything about them on our channel all i can really tell you guys is they're okay they're fine they're just taking a break that's pretty much all i want to say i don't want to see any more comments about it like they are our mates they are actually our really good friends and 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 just let them do whatever they want to do until they feel comfortable until they feel right to just say whatever they want to say let them do whatever they want to do please that's the biggest elephant in the room and i sort of just want to 
swap that right away really quick. Anyway guys, if you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to go ham on that thumbs up button. Uh, August 1st, 6 p.m. we're doing our online job. Do not forget about that. 6 p.m. Australian Eastern Standard Time, so whatever Melbourne time is, I'm not too sure what it is around the world, but everything, nearly, nearly, um, I'm gonna say, nearly everything is going to be available, but a lot of the sizes are running out, so like, for example, there's this neck logo tee that everyone wants. There's literally just one size large and one size extra large on that. Um, and some like the black and white blossom hoodies, we found some um, from our our pop-ups. We really need to find a way to stop actually uh, pulling out so much display stock. It's actually really annoying because I give it all away. I don't try to sell it because I like everyone to receive everything in nice looking packages and stuff like that. But we really just want to give it all away. We found uh, like two Blossom hoodies, like a few other things, this, this accessories. Uh, Philly just restocked on the beanies as well so you guys can be able to purchase the beanies. Um, a lot of female stuff, a lot of male stuff, a lot of unisex stuff, and um, I appreciate you guys so freaking much. I'll see you guys on the next video. We're gonna bounce right now. Peace.